Chapter 3 Our Changing Earth The lithosphere is broken into a number of plates, so called lithospheric plates. Meaning of lithospheric plates The Earth's crust consists of several large and some small, rigid, irregularly shaped plates, also known as slabs which carry continents and the ocean floor. These plates are called lithospheric plates. You will be surprised to know that these plates move around very slowly, just a few millimeters each year. This is because of the movement of the molten magma inside the earth. The molten magma inside the earth moves in a circular manner as shown in the activity. Activity Take a small colored paper palette and put it in a beaker half filled with water. Place the beaker on a tripod stand and heat it. As the water warms up, you will observe that the paper pallet is moving upward along the warm layers of water and then sinks back along with the cooler layers of water. The molten magma inside the earth moves in a similar manner. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें एंडोजेनिक फोर्सेस एंड एक्सोजेनिक फोर्सेस द मूवमेंट ऑफ दीज प्लेट्स कॉसेस चेंजेस ऑन द सरफेस ऑफ द अर्थ द अर्थ मूवमेंट्स आर डिवाइडेड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ द फोर्सेस व्हिच कॉस देम the forces which act in the interior of the earth are called as endogenic forces and the forces that work on the surface of the earth are called as exogenic forces. Earthquake and volcanoes Endogenic forces sometimes produce sudden movements and at the other times produce Slow movements. Sudden movements like earthquake and volcanoes cause mass destruction over the surface of the earth. Well, endo means inside and genic means origin. So endogenic together means inside origin. Exo means outside. And genic means origin. So exogenic means outside origin. A volcano is a vent or an opening in the earth's crust through which molten material erupts suddenly. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें Activity Take a container, fill it with water and close it with a lid. Put the water to boil. Now put some peas, spoon and beads on top of the lid. What do you notice? Correct! As the water boils, the lid begins to shake. The things which you have put on the lid also vibrate. The beads roll down and the spoon vibrates to make a sound. In the same manner, the earth vibrates when an earthquake occurs. Earthquakes Similarly, when the lithospheric plates move, the surface of the earth vibrates. The vibrations can travel all round the earth. The vibrations are called earthquakes. The place in the crust 
where the movement starts is called the focus. The place on the surface above the focus is called the epicenter. Vibrations travel outwards from the epicenter as waves. Greatest damage is usually closest to the epicenter and the strength of the earthquake decreases away from the center. Although earthquakes cannot be predicted, the impact can certainly be minimized if we are prepared beforehand. Some common earthquake prediction methods adopted locally by people include studying animal behavior, fish in the ponds get agitated, snakes come to the surface. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें ऐसे ही और एजुकेशनल वीडियोस देखने के लिए हमारे चैनल होम रिवाइज को सब्सक्राइब करें